What is a fairy? Rudolf Steiner, turn of the century scientist, educator and philosopher, developer of biodynamic gardening and Waldorf education, understood the limitation of scientific explanation. In order to describe what science cannot, he interpreted an elaborate system of fairies and elementals. He might say they all exist like electricity or magnetism. Just because you can't see it, it doesn't mean it's not there. Steiner explains, the gnome has the ability to pass through rocks or metal. They are bound together mostly by gravity. Only the full moon can slow them down. The gnome is like a super miner moving the still mineral to become an even more useful form. Almost like the air to us, they can pass through the solid mass. Their favorite job is to carry minerals to the roots of plants, delivering them to the Undine and Sylph fairies. Steiner explains, the Undine fairy thrive in fluid and liquid worlds, like mixing chemicals that come from minerals, transforming all manner of substance. They can be found in the dewdrops on the leaves, in the sap in the trees, and in the puddles after a rainstorm. They surround the plants with their energy. The biggest job is forming the leaves. Like the leaves, or like a dream, they change their form constantly. Undine's energy is met by the intense weavings of light created by the sylphs. Every new plant is like a new and beautiful weaving. The light is modulated by the air in beautiful rhythms. Sylphs form and take wing like the birds in a dreamy musical world of wind and air, a cosmic and almost symphonic music. After the plant has grown as far as the sylph can carry it, it is brought to the fiery salamander elemental. The salamander fairy carries its terrific etheric energies into the blossoms. Awaiting the pollen, the salamander carries the warmth into the seed to create a seed bud. The salamanders change the neutral atmospheric warmth into a living, warm blossom. Surrounding every plant form is a hive of intense and all-pervasive, enthusiastic, even ecstatic energy of fairies. Fairies who love what they're doing. Love is fundamental. But without nature, no love. Unless nature is love.